Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you all of my uh, lipstick, lip gloss, liquid lip, everything related to lip uh, collection. I am sure I'm gonna have some declutters here and there. If you like collection videos, please keep on watching. Uh, give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and let's go ahead and get into it. It's a big one. I tried to pull everything out that I have. Um, I will be zooming you guys in in just a minute, but I tried to give you the full picture. It's a lot. Um, I think most likely I am going to go ahead and start with bullet lipsticks, and then we'll move on. Um, unless like I find some stuff here and there. That's liquid lip. This is liquid lip. This is lip gloss lip gloss lip liners uh like lip balm scrubs and whatnot okay so i have bullet lipsticks here bullet lipsticks here bullet lipsticks here i don't think i have any in here i think these are kind of like lip glosses and liquid lips that i needed to stand up um some lip crayons will do as well and then more bullet lipsticks here let me sort of Go ahead and move these out of the way. Okay, we'll go ahead and get started with bullet lipsticks. Um, I don't know how much I'm gonna be decluttering from this category, but I, I will just share everything that I have with you. Let me pull all of these out. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. Let me scooch things back. We'll get started. The first one I have over here is by Essence. This is one of the Matte 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 06 shades. Um, I actually do really like this one. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. So I think this might be a hold on to. I'm going to put it to the side. Um, by uh, Urban Decay. This is a comfort matte and this is in the shade Doubt. This is a pretty red, but I find it to be a little too orangey. I don't know if I want to swatch because this is going to be a nightmare if I do swatch. Maybe I'll just swatch the ones that I'm not so sure about. Um, it's going to be a pain to like clean up. Actually, it looks really nice. Let me see the Essence one. Okay, it's definitely dry, but it still looks pretty good. Okay, I guess we'll hold on to We're going to see a lot of reds just fyi <laughs> um let's do hazard this red by wet n wild i think maybe this is one i will go ahead and let go of um this is um damn it so creamy oh dang this is gonna be difficult you guys okay i don't know what i'm gonna do with that one what's this this is by kylie and this is the shade boss this is a matte lipstick um Oh, that's really pretty. Okay. Um, let's see. More uh, reds. I have this one by Sephora. This is the hashtag lip stories. And this is in the shade A Little Magic. Um, I have this one. And then I have another one. Just checking to make sure nothing is growing on it. Nothing is growing on it. But I know this is old. Okay. There's that one. Where's the, I have another one. Maybe I decluttered it last time I did this declutter. Um, okay, so I think I'm going to let go of the Sephora one. And I am going to go ahead and let go of the one by Wet n Wild. So, two so far. Okay, let's move right on. Uh, let's see, I can't remember what is red. This is red and I know I'm going to hold on to this one. This is by Patrick Ta. And this is in the shade, that's why she's late. I'm definitely going to hold on to this one. Um, another red, and this is by Pure. This is the Barbie collab. Oof, this is beautiful. And I love the packaging of this guy. So I'm definitely going to hold on to this one. These are like the ones I know for sure I'm going to keep. Um, I have a couple over here, but these are... This one is a newer one to me. This is by uh, the collab with Mac and Keith Herring. Um, yeah, I, I'm, this is new. I haven't used it yet. I've only swatched it. This is definitely staying. And for now, we're keeping the packaging. <laughs> um, this is another red. This is by uh, Charlotte Tilbury. Ooh, I love this one. This was a gift. Um, I'm definitely keeping this one. This is in the shade Patsy Red. Um, this is another red. This is Mac Viva and this is the Seiya collab. I love this shade. It's so beautiful too. Now hold on and this hold on to this one. 
Um, let's see. No, this is another red. This is ColourPop uh, Hocus Pocus collab, and this is in the shade Mary. Okay, I've used this one for sure. Yeah, I, I get a. It's, it's staying. She is staying. Um, let's see. These are reds. One is, I think this is the Viva Glam One. This is so pretty, you guys. And then the packaging is just gorgeous as well. I'm going to go ahead and keep this one. MAC uh, Russian Red. This was a, I think it was a Chinese New Year uh, edition. It's so pretty and I love the color. Um, let me see. This is also, no, this is, this is pinkish. I guess it doesn't really matter. We'll just keep going. Um, by Mented, this is the red carpet matte lipstick. These are just so underrated. This is so pretty. Here's this one. And then I have one that's not red from them. It's more of a, uh, like a nude. Ooh, this is so pretty. I think this is soft peach. Oh, peach, please. This is so pretty on the lips. I love this thing. Definitely holding on to those. Um, okay. Let's see, what else do we have? We I have this guy by Milani. I used to really, really like it and it got squished. My son squished it. And I just kind of like, I haven't been reaching for it um, for that reason, but it's a really pretty one. I don't know if they still make these. These are the matte creamy and this is in the shade 80. It's so pretty. I'm gonna get, go ahead and set that on the side. This is one of my favorite lipsticks. This is in the shade Liar um, by uh, Urban Decay. And this is a cream. I love this shade. It's so beautiful. I'm gonna go ahead and hold on to that. By Bare Minerals, this is in the shade Strip. This is another one that's like super comfortable on the lips. It just feels amazing on the lips. Um, yeah, okay. <laughs> I <laughs> we're not doing too well we're not doing too well okay um by pat mcgrath this is in the shade 1995 i know that these um i had two of them go bad on me still pretty good i'm gonna hold on to this one and i think is that the last mini i have of her possibly um let's see this is by mac and this is in the shade only upon the stars or once once upon the stars i can't read it's a really pretty neutral yeah i'm gonna go ahead hold on to this one let me see this one this is in the shade jar of stars this was like a which holiday collection last year maybe these are both pretty i'm gonna hold on to both of these okay let's move on by uh bite this is hashtag bite of nyc Okay, this is one I definitely get a check because I know these go bad. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to let this one go. I don't know what that is over here. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and have to let go of this one. Okay, let's see what else. This is another one by Bite and this is in the shade Maple. Okay, this looks just fine. Nothing wrong with it. I'm gonna go ahead and hold on to this and let's see we have mac this is in the shade chili mm, beautiful 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 oh yeah that's pretty um we have mac this is in the shade uh ladybug Ooh, that's beautiful i don't even remember this guy when did i get it where is that? It's a cream. It's not a matte. Uh, this is by Wayne Goss, and this is in the shade Dahlia. I do really, really like this one, but I think I'm going to let it go just because the shade is a little bit not, I don't know. I mean, it's good with a uh, lip line on the list, but I guess these are dark, uh, lighter and I feel like they work for me. Okay, let's put that guy over here um we have by color drain this is in the shade may she rain this is the only colored by colored uh rain uh, lippy i have and i think i might have got rid of all these like mauvey tones um i think i'm gonna go ahead and let this one go too 
I haven't been really enjoying these tones um, by Kylie. Well, I may, maybe just swatched this one. This is in the shade Madeline, and this is one of the cream formulas. Okay, I like this one. I kind of don't like Boss seeing it next to the other ones. Looks like too orangey, doesn't it? Hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and do hashtag lip stories, and this is in the shade Spring Break. This is really, really pretty. I'm going to keep this one. Um, by Dose of Colors, I have two. These are the collabs with Desi and Katie. One is in the shade Aftermath, and one is in the shade Hey Girl. So this is Hey Girl, and Aftermath is this one. Jeez, I used the crap out of this. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and hold on to this one as well. <sighs> Whew. Let's see. By Becca, I know Becca. This is in the shade Petal. The formula of these is really nice. This is the only one I have from her. And I think it's okay, but I feel like I'm not going to reach for it. Okay, let's do this one. This is by Real Her. I'm definitely going to keep this one. I've only like swatched it by Pat McGrath. This is in the shade um, Major Red, but this is a cream. It's not a matte. Hold on to that. One of the, this is Christy, another favorite, favorite neutral. Love it. And then Venus and Furs. This is really pretty too. And, oh, why did that not want to close? Last one by Pat. This is in the shade um, Flush Fatale, but this is a Blitz Trans lipstick. This was a gift from my husband. Um, I do really, really like it, so I'm definitely going to keep it. Okay, what else do we have here? I know this one is going to be a declutter. It got completely squashed, um, got destroyed by my son, but it's okay. I'm going to take it back to MAC. This is in the shade A Wink of Pink. Um, I, this is a favorite. This is by Too Faced, and this is a Gingerbread Man. Yes, really pretty. These two definitely stay in by Milani. This is in the shade Tease. I just gotta say, I discovered these way before TikTok, you guys. And this is in the shade Pleasure. Pleasure? Yes, Pleasure. So pretty. Way before they went viral and you know no longer available anywhere um this is in a project this is uh bobby brown i'm definitely gonna keep this one and then this is a newer one look how pretty this is this is by beauty bakery and this is in the shade raspberry haven't used it yet but i do want to or iced raspberry so i'm gonna keep that one um over here i have these by besame i think i'm gonna keep all three of them unless they went bad this is in the shade victory red Beautiful red. These are just amazing reds. Um, another one by uh, Besame is in the shade Besame Red. This is so pretty. This is the brightest of all three that I have. And then Victory Red, or Red Velvet, sorry, is the last one. This is the darkest one. It looks like it's stabbed, but that was my son. My child did that, but we're, we're, we're holding on to her. Okay, let's do these three over here. Um, MAC, this is in the shade Out With A Bang. This was holiday of last year. Definitely keeping this uh, completely out of my comfort zone. It doesn't look as dark as it does in, like, in the tube, but my friend sent me that. This is in the shade um, Rouge On Snow. Another beautiful red. And then this last one is in the shade Shimmer and Spice. This is a weird one. Like, this is absolutely weird. Um, it's pretty unique, but I don't know. I'm holding on to it because it's the packaging is just stunning. Okay, let's do these three. This is by Charlotte Tilbury, and this is in the shade Bitch Perfect. Another one that got completely destroyed, but I'm holding on to that. Uh, velvet underground this is an under the shade is underground this is one of her velvet lipsticks I really like this one too 
And this is the uh, Jessica Rapid Ciate London collab. Oh, this is so pretty. I've used it like two or three times and I don't want to use it anymore. It's just gorgeous. So these are not going anywhere. I think probably these two uh, are as well. <laughs> um, we have MAC Flat Out Fabulous. This is a crazy, crazy color. Um, I don't really wear it very often, but this is the only kind of like mauve bright color I have. And I actually can wear it some days. This is in the shade Relentlessly Red. This is definitely a bright, bright red. Keeping that. Um, kind of sexy. It's a beautiful nude. Absolutely keeping. Let's do these. One jump ahead. What's this called? Um, this is called Whole New World. This is the Aladdin collab. Ooh, so pretty. Look how gorgeous this is. So pretty. Um, we have Cream in Your Coffee classic and it's beautiful and looks like I had chaplets when I used it and this one is in the shade Mer, 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 I don't know how to say it, really popular shade on YouTube and then this last one is in the shade uh, Ruby Woo, this is the retro matte, one of my favorite favorites, okay so now we get to these three. This is uh, Wet n Wild and this is in the shade uh, Bear It All. Remember when this was just so popular? But I think I'm gonna let it go. I have other nudes that I like a lot more. Um, this is by Milani and this is kind of like a balmy lip, which is fine. Looks really nice on the lips too and it's hydrating. And then this is by It Cosmetics, and this is in the shade Cinnamon. It's not really a sh Oh, Humble. It's not really a shade that I've been wanting to use. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and let this one go. Let this one go. And I think I'm definitely going to go ahead and let go of the Wayne Goss one. It's just not really suit me very well. So I'm going to let that one go too. Okay, I think... What do we have? We have the Milani one. The Milani is so pretty. Um, it's destroyed, but I'm going to keep it. All right. Okay, let's move on to this section. I don't know. Most of the stuff, I'm not really sure what's in here. Um, I, I, at some point, I just like I started running out of space in other places. So I just started putting things in here. Okay, and then we'll tackle these over here. Well, oh, let's just wait on those. Okay, we'll do this section. Oh, I have a bullet lipstick and I do really like this one. I'm definitely going to keep it. So this one is staying. Okay, um, let's move on to this section. Some that I know I got to get rid of because they're just so old. Probably some of the oldest in my collection are these which is a bummer i do really really like them but let me actually see okay does not smell weird or anything what about this one nope they smell just fine this one this one smells good too what about this one mm, this one looks very very used is the shade swing i'm gonna go ahead and let go of the shade swing looks like pretty much almost out so i'm gonna let go of this one i'm gonna keep these three these are by nars and these are this is in the shade vault rosalind and spike so i know i thought i was gonna get rid of them but i'm not okay let's do those red by nars and i know i'm gonna keep all all of them i have um these two are like a little bit bigger those are the power mat by NARS, uh, I do really like the formula, so I'm gonna go ahead and keep uh, Cherry Bomb and I'm keeping Don't Stop for sure. Keeping these, and then I have three minis uh, one is in the shade uh, Wonder Woman, American Woman, this is in the shade Vein, and this is in the shade Star Woman. I'm keeping all three of these as well. Okay. Uh, this one's gotta go. 
so I'll put it over here. Um, by Ilia, I have two lip oils. One is in the shade Tahiti and one is in the shade Saint. I've used up one of Tahiti's last uh, last year. I did enjoy it a little bit. This is a lot better, the shade Saint. I like it a lot more. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep the shade Saint and I'm gonna let go of Tahiti. I used one, didn't like it so much that I would wanna reuse another one. I think it came like a... I might not even opened it. I think it came in like a, a gift with purchase or something like that. So that one is got to go. Um, by Fenty, I do like this one a lot. This is the Fenty Glow. I'm definitely going to keep this one. And I have the Fenty uh, Cream. This is uh, the Fenty Glow, but this is a cream version. So I'm going to keep this one as well. So there's that one. Um, another one by Fenty. This is a little tiny one and this is in the shade Fussy. This is the pinkish one. I do really like that one a lot. Um, by Bare Minerals, this is where it gets hard. These kind of like survived a previous declutter, but then I barely use them because they're so tacky. I mean, they're beautiful, but so tacky. This is Gen Nude and this is in the shade Everything. I'm going to have to narrow it down. I mean, okay. This is pretty. This is in the shade Rebel. This is a lip gloss, I believe. But these are just so tacky. Oh, I hate it. I'm gonna let go of this one. I don't like tacky lippies. Um, this is a Gen Nude and this is in the shade Can't Even. I don't even feel like this is something I would wear. Yep, nope, this is gonna go, it's too light. And then I have this guy in the shade Heartbreaker. Looks like a shade I would wear. I'm gonna keep this one. So I'm keeping these two and I got rid of two. So these are gonna stay. Okay, let's do um, the Buxom ones. I have a couple by Buxom. Um, okay, uh, this is in the shade, this is a cream one. This is the lip cream and this is in the shade Rose Julep. Okay, beautiful. A cream and this is in the shade Kristen. I know I like Kristen a lot. I'm gonna keep Kristen. What are these? This is another lip cream. Um, this is in the shade Dolly. I honestly prefer the lip polish version of Dolly. Um, I just find it, this one is okay though. They're not as tacky as the Bare Minerals, thank goodness. And then this one is in the shade Sophia. I do like Sophia as well. So I'm keeping all four. Okay, let's, uh, these two, I'm definitely gonna keep Tower 28. This is in the shade XOXO, and this is chill. Love them. Super comfortable. Absolutely keeping. Uh, this is by uh, Serafina Botan Seraphine Botanicals. I love this thing. Um, it's called a, what do they call it? A lip gel. I just, I love it. So comfortable on the lips. Definitely keeping that one. Uh, Clarins Lip Comfort Oil, and this is like a shimmer. I don't know. So, um, I guess it's okay. Oh, let's put it to the side. Uh, I have this one by Jewel Smith. I do really like this one. This came in an Ipsy bag. I do actually enjoy it. Um, I think I'm going to let go of this, uh, this one by uh, Pat McGrath. This is in the shade Celestial Ruby. I like it. I just, it's uh, too, um, like, a, what, is, it's like, what is it called? Like, chromey, you know? That. I'm gonna let go of that one. These two I'm definitely gonna keep. This one is in the shade Blood 2 and this one is in the shade Flesh 6. I'm keeping these two. Um, this is Beauty For Real. I think this also came in an Ipsy bag. Remember this was such a comfortable lip gloss but do I need another one? Hmm, let me try it on. Hmm, feels comfortable. I'm keeping it. And then this guy is by Shiseido. Um, this is a little tiny sample shimmer gel gloss in the shade 7. I'm going to keep it. I should pan this one. It's tiny. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and let go of these two. Okay. And then the last section in here is uh, um, lip crowns. I wonder if I want to do that or if I want to go ahead and do lip glosses. I guess let's do the lip like, crayon, the pencils thing. Um, okay. Ooh, this is going to be, uh, yeah. By L'Oreal. This is in the shade Little Chili. I do like this one a lot. So I'm going to, um, don't want to start, don't want to swatch again. My hand is stained. Yeah, I like this one. 
Mm, I do like these by uh, Maybelline a lot. One is in Hustle and Heels. I think this is Hustle and Heels. Yes, one is in the shade Enjoy the View and one is in the shade Pave the Road. I like all of them, so I'm going to keep all of them. I just, they don't fit in here. We're going to have to figure out another solution to that. Ooh, this one is not going anywhere. This is by Lipstick Queen and this is Rear View. Rear View Mirror and the shade is Little Red Convertible. I'm definitely keeping that one. Okay, this one might have been might have gone bad. This is Palm Granite by uh, Bite. Um, yeah, this is so old. I'm going to go ahead and let go of this one. This is, I just don't feel comfortable using it, honestly. It's, it's old. So I'm going to go ahead and let go of this one. Um, let me see. By Colourpop. I haven't checked this one in a while. This is in the shade Trust Me. Oh, gosh. And it completely fell out of the tube. Um, yeah, this is okay. Just needs to be pushed back in. Pretty, so pretty. Um, this one is by Tristique, and this is in the shade Chili Red. I do really like these by Tristique, so I think I'm going to keep all of them. Chili Red, this one is in the shade uh, Tuscan Wine. This is in the shade Florence Fig. I love it. This is in the shade Barcelona. I don't remember this one. It's a bright pink. You know, I'm going to go ahead and let go of this one. I don't remember it. And I'm keeping this one for sure. This is in the shade Belize Bordeaux. These are definitely staying. Okay, another one by Tristique is this one. And this is in the shade English Rose. Um, this came in a boxy, boxy charm or something like that. I'm going to keep this one. The formula of the Tristique Lippies is really, really nice. By NARS, this is in the shade Vesuvio. Ves Vesuvio, something like that. Let me see. Okay, and then Cruella. I do have a full size of Cruella currently. Um, I'm going to let go of the mini Cruella. I do have a full size. I'm going to pull in the full size. I think I'm going to let go of this one, the uh, matte lipstick by NARS. I don't even remember. I think I got it from like a uh, beauty discount store. Um, this is in the shade, uh, or this is Laka. This is in the shade Sun Shower. I think I'm going to let go of this one. Okay, let's move on. This one is new to me. This is by Colourpop. This is the Blotted Lip. I haven't used it much, so I'm definitely going to hold on to this one. This is by uh, Nude Sticks. This is in the shade Belle. Oh, I like Belle. I think I got rid of all the ones I didn't like. This is by Bare Minerals. Oh, no, Nude Sticks, and this is in the shade Naughty and Spice. It's pretty, too. Okay, this is a little tiny uh, lip crayon, uh, but it's buxom in the shade is Dolly. I'm going to keep this one. By Dose of Colors, this is the Mickey collab. And I'm going to go ahead and let go of this one. This is not a color I would wear. I don't know why I bought it. Um, I have this one from Fenty, and this is like the Mademoiselle lipsticks, and this is in the shade Madame. Um, I think they're Mademoiselle. I can't remember the line, but... This is really, really pretty, but my goodness, did it transfer. Actually, it's really pretty. It doesn't feel very creamy. Maybe I'm mistaken about the color. I'm going to hold on to this one. This is by e.l.f. Um, this is the Sheer Stick, and this is in the shade Dragon Fruit. I do like this occasionally. I'm going to go ahead and hold on to it. And by Hourglass, I have uh, the Confession Lipstick, and this is in the shade Red Zero. This is just stunning. I love the packaging. I'm going to go ahead and hold on to this one as well. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and move on. I think I'm gonna do uh, um, lip glosses next. I do have a lot of lip glosses. They are, to be honest, lip gloss is probably my favorite lip category. Um, I just love them. <laughs> okay, 
These were in my uh, like everyday uh, makeup drawer, shop my stash, and this is in a project. I'm gonna hold on to these. Um, this is by Roman. I actually really love this guy, so I'm definitely gonna hold on to this one. Um, this is by The Balm, Plump Your Pucker lip gloss. Really enjoy it. And then the ones by Maybelline, I do really like them. This is in the shade Petal. I'm gonna keep Petal. And then two, maybe three more. Um, this is in the shade Stone and Amber. I'm gonna go ahead and keep. Uh, okay um probably not gonna be getting rid of many lip glosses but we'll see how it goes um let's see this is by moira the i tried one of their other lippies and it smelled like i mean it just smelled a little bit i know it's just the scent of their lip product but i was not very happy with it i think this is yeah it's pretty color I'm gonna go ahead and hold on to it. This is the only one. I think I ended up getting rid of the red one, maybe. Maybe that one really smelled. So I'm gonna hold on to this guy. Um, let's see. I think I should probably let go of this one. This is by Laura Geller. This is the color Sugarcane. I've had it for a really long time. I gotta let go of that one. Um, by uh, uh, Grande, I do really like all of these. Uh, this is in the clear shade. This is Mauve, or Spicy Mauve. And this is in the shade Barely There. I do like all three of them. I'm definitely going to keep these. One of my favorite lip formulas. Um, this is by Becca. I know it's like it's separated. It's so old. I got to go ahead and let this one go. This is in the shade uh, Glow Gloss. I'm going to let that one go. I think I had two by Becca. There's got to be somewhere here. Another one here. Um, this is by uh, Laura Geller. This is a luster lip gloss. And this is in the shade Diamond something so pretty but do i wear this stuff i don't know let's hold on to that um one that i know i really really like and this is this is the full-on plumping lip polish and this is in the shade peppa pumpkin definitely keeping this one this is by buckstone keeping this one um stay glossy by Rimmel. i do like these um like the clear glosses i find them you know i do use them so i'm gonna keep both of these um, this is by Patrick Todd. This is the monochrome moment and this is in the shade She's Secure. I'm going to keep that one. Okay, let's see. What else do we have? These two, I do really like them. These are by Rare Beauty. One is in the shade Nearly Apricot and Nearly Moth. Super comfortable. Love them. I'm going to hold on to these. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and let this one go. It's pretty old. This is Stay Glossy and this is by Rimmel. I don't know what the shade was. Um, by Bobbi Brown, the Crushed Oil uh, Infused Gloss. I do really like these. I have two, maybe I have three of them, three of them. Um, this is in the shade, this one is in the shade Sweet Talk, in the shade Free Spirit and Hot Streak. Um, they don't look nearly as they look in the in the tube, like this is not a bright orange. They, they blend in really well on the, on the lips. They look really pretty. I'm gonna go ahead and hold on to these. Um, by Bare Minerals, this is a Gen Nude, and this is in the shade Addicted. Let's see. Okay, the problem with these are just they feel so thick. I can't, I can't deal with that. I gotta let that one go. Um, what is this one? This is by Glam Light, and this is in the shade Pecan Pie. Okay, still smells good. Um, I have one of the same light. These two I do really, really like. This is in the shade Caramel, and this is in the shade Eggnog. Um, let me see the formula of this one. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and hold on to it. I'm going to hold on to all three of these. Okay. Um, I have these by NYX. Uh, one is in the shade Angel Food Cake. I might let go of this one. This is pretty old. I... It doesn't smell or anything, but I know it's old. I'm going to go ahead and let go of this one. This is newer, much newer. And this is in the shade Bit of Honey. And this is Milk and Honey. I'm going to go ahead and keep both of these. Um, a really old one. I just got to let go of this. This is Too Faced and this is the Sweet Peach Creamy Peach Lip Gloss, Oil, Oil Lip Gloss. This is in the shade Tickle Me Peach. I did really enjoy it when it was new, but it's super old. Um, okay. Definitely going to keep these uh, and I'll tell you what they are. Okay, these two are by Tower 28. One is in the shade Coconut and one is in the shade Cashew. 
I love them. And then this is by Kaja, and this is in the shade um, Honey Drizzle. Love it. Love, love these a lot. Okay, by Buxom. This is a uh, one that I do really like. I am gonna go ahead and keep this. This is in the shade Claire. Um, by Milani. Let me see. This is uh, Natural Luster. It smells really good. Still delicious, actually. Let me see this one. This is in the shade Luminoso. Really nice. And then this one is in the shade Bronze something. Rosy Bronze. Oh yeah, I'm keeping all three. They smell really good, and I do really like the formula. Um, okay, another one by Tower 28. I'm gonna keep this one. This is in the shade Spicy. Okay, this one I do. Really, these two I do really like. This is by Persona. Yeah, and this is in the shade Toffee, and this is by Patrick Ta, and this is in the shade She's Expensive. Can I keep these? Um, let's see. The Barbie collab with Pure. I'm gonna keep it um jazzy from dose of colors gonna keep this one i think i'm like i'm gonna go ahead and let this one go this is by bare minerals and this is 24 carats i don't like the formula and i'm gonna go ahead and let go of the laura Geller one as well um this by bella and argent i do really like this one really pigmented and beautiful um red velvet velvet lip perfector by clarence um i'm gonna go ahead and hold on to it i actually enjoyed it once i figured out like you know the proper way to use it by dose of colors this is the um mickey collab this one i think i gotta keep this one it's so cute this is in the shade Mwah. i'm gonna keep that this is by persona and i do really like this one this is in the shade coral by basic beauty this came in ipsy shade literally i'm gonna keep this and then what do we have here pout bomb by uh revolution this is in the shade kiss ginormous okay i'm gonna go ahead and keep this one it does not look bad at all okay guys we're getting there we got liquid lips liquid lips i kind of had separated them <laughs> one for mattes and one for reds um so we'll go through them real quick red liquid lips let's do this um by uh Too Faced. I know I'm not using them often, but I'm gonna go ahead and keep a couple of these. This is Cinnamon Bear. I do really, really like this one. And I do really like the shade Candy Cane, so I'm gonna keep both of these. Um, I'm definitely keeping the one by Persona. This is in the shade Holy Grail. Um, let's see, something leaked. I could see the oils. That's the problem with the liquid lips. They leak. Um, okay, I'm going to go ahead and let go of this one. Hank and Henry. It's pretty old. It's really drying. I'm going to let go of that one. Um, this is one of the Sephora Cream Lip Shine. Why is it in here? I'm not sure. I'm going to keep it. This is pretty comfortable. Kylie. This is in the shade Surprise Me. Was this like the free gift from Ulta or something? Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with this one. Okay, this one, I know this leaks and has to constantly be standing up, but this is by Pat McGrath and this is Revelation Red. I do really like this one a lot. Um, by ColourPop, this is the Velvet Lux. This is in the shade Big Bang. This is newer. Okay. I think I'm gonna go ahead and let go of the Kylie one. I don't think it's color I would wear, but let's do these next to it. By Dose of Colors, and I, like the stickers on these just fell off and now they have different uh, packaging. So I wouldn't be able to tell you what they are. Here's one and then here's the other one. Um, I'm gonna let go of this one. I'm gonna keep this one, whatever that was. Okay, this one is by Jolie Cosmetics. I think I'm going to go ahead and let go of this one. Looks really dried up in there. Oh, no, it's actually not. Um, okay. Uh, Velvet, Red Velvet by Glamline. I love this one. I'm going to keep it. Let's see. This is by Moira. This is in the shade Heartbreaker. This was pretty nice when I used it. So I think I'm going to go ahead and hold on to it. 
um, Berry, uh, Amore Matte, this is in shade Amore by Milani. This is really, really pretty, a really pretty color. I do really like the formula. I'm gonna keep this one, definitely getting rid of Kylie. Okay, that fell. Um, by Lime Crime, this is in the shade Red Rose. This is getting old. Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and let go of this one. Something my sister would really enjoy, actually. Uh, another one by Too Faced. I do really like these. Caramel Apple, I'm gonna keep it. This is by Buxom. This is the Vava Plump. I'm gonna keep it. Um, Jolie, 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 Jolie. I'm gonna let go of Jolie Cosmetics. Um, Maybelline, this is in the shade uh, Dancer. Let me see this guy. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and let go of this one. And I need a new container for my letting go. And I'm going to keep these. This is by Lancome, by Ofra, and by Giorgio Armani. I'm keeping. Yes, it's official. My hand is stained. What did I expect? I'm swatching. Uh, this is the Bare Minerals. This, These are like the Juju lip uh, mattes. Those are actually really nice. This is in the shade Friendship. Oh, I don't like the color at all. Okay, I thought I had another one of these. Um, maybe I'm just not seeing it. Oh, I really enjoyed this one. This is one of the uh, Power Oils lip gloss. This is lip gloss. Why is it not in the lip gloss section? I'm keeping that one. Um, by Pop Beauty. This is in the shade Berry Boost. Oh, this is one of the reds. I'm going to go ahead and keep this one. Okay, we have the Lux uh, Velvet by uh, ColourPop. This is the shade Le Burge. I do really like this one. This is by Ofra, but this is so old. It's I, I wouldn't be surprised if this is just like straight up dry. I'm gonna let go of that one. I don't know the name of it. Um, this is by Pure, and this is in the shade, oh my God, um, Twinsies. Twinsies. Yeah, no, that's got to go too. It's so dried up first. Second, don't wear these shades. Okay, these two I think are going to go. Okay, this one I do really like by Too Faced. And this is Hot Toddy. I'm keeping that one. I am going to go ahead and keep Hot Butter Drum. And I'm going to go ahead and keep Pumpkin Spice. Um, this one by Dose of Colors is in the shade Warm and Fuzzy. I do really like this shade as well. I do not like this shade by L'Oreal. I'm going to go ahead and let it go. This is in the shade 418, Empower. Um, by Rare Beauty, this is in the shade uh, Confident. I think this was the birthday gift recently from Sephora. I'm going to keep that one. By Moira, this is the shade A La Mode. I like that one. Uh, this is by Beauty Creations, and this is in the shade Sweetheart. Let me see. Okay, can stay. She can stay uh, by uh, Revolution, Makeup Revolution. This is in the shade Nude Magnet. So freaking bulky. Ooh, yeah, no. I do not like that lip color at all. That's got to go. Um, by the Balm, this is in the shade Salut. I had finished one of these, and then I got another one in Ipsy. I think I'll let it go. Did not like it. I mean, I liked it, but I don't think I want to use it again. Um, by Marc Jacobs, this is the shade Slow Burn. I'm going to keep this one. Um, this is by L'Oreal. I don't know. I can't remember what the shade was. I tried to finish this guy last year, but I failed. It's pretty. I'm going to keep it. By Dose of Colors, Desi Katie, and this is the shade My Man. Okay. Um, I'm going to keep it. It's a pretty weird color, but I do like it. And then the last few, this is by Lottie London, Slay All Day. This is in the shade Fleek. By Kylie, this is the Ulta one. This is the Ulta Beauty one. Let me see the shade here. Okay, I don't mind this one at all. I keep this one. I have one by Ofra, and this is Laguna Beach, and one by uh, Lime Crime. This is in the shade Clover. Remember, really liking this one. Yeah, I like this one. All right, this is it um, for liquid lips. Okay, so far, these are all the declutters. Let's go ahead. I don't know that I'm going to be getting rid of uh, many lip liners. I usually just pack them on or just, you know, 
but this past year I picked up way too many. Um, I, I, I do like most of them. And okay, this one is like, I don't know what to do with it. I'm gonna go and let it go. It's time to let go of this bite one. I do like this one. Yeah, I typically just like, I'll ask my sisters-in-law if they're interested. Um, so I don't like to really hold on to lip liners that I don't use, but I'm gonna go ahead and let go of these two. And then lastly, for lip balms and uh, like lip oils and all that, um, these I do really like this one by Huda, one of my favorites, really nice. I do really enjoy it a lot. This one is newer to me by Milani. I tried it and I did really, really enjoy it. Um, by Fresh, I'm keeping both of these, Mango and Passion Fruit. Um, this is a newer purchase for me. This is by Beauty Bakery. This is the Sugar uh, Lip Scrub and this is in the Scent Peach or Taste Peach. I do like this one. This is amazing. This is by LYS. Um, I do really, really like it. Um, Bright or Die Lip Balm. I haven't used this one yet. I've only used the minty one. These are by ELF. Um, yeah, I'm going to keep both of these. This is Pumpkin or Pumpkin. I can't remember what it's called. Tough Cookie. I'm going to keep it. I, I think I'm keeping most of these. Um, I don't think that I'm going to declutter any of them, to be honest. Um, this is from the dentist and, um, these are, I mean, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna, I, I, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna declutter any. This is Mac. This is Carmax. Um, another Seraphine Botanicals. I do really like their lip products. Do enjoy that one. I haven't tried this one yet. This is by Kiehl's. Um, this is the Cosmetics Genesis Qua. Made a nice dent in that one. Um, this is by Becca. Let me see. I think this was a free gift. Yeah, feels really nice. I'm going to go ahead and keep it. And then here, what do I have? I have this by Bobbi Brown. I cannot wait to use it. This is in the shade Extra. This is a lip tint, like a balmy lip tint. I've used it a couple times. I really enjoyed it. Context Nude Balm. This, I think this came in Ipsy. Honestly, I didn't feel like it was hydrating. Oh, yeah, it looks pretty hydrating. I'm gonna have to use it a little bit more. Um, this is Nars Laguna and Tarte uh, Maracuja Juicy Lip. And then lastly, I have the Merit. Uh, this is the shade Marrakesh. I love this thing. Really, really pretty on the lips. So that concludes that. And I think that's it. I mean, that's it, you guys, unless there's something in my purse, which if it's in my purse, I am using it or sitting on my nightstand. I do have a lip balm and a lip mask, a Laneige lip mask, and one by Dalton uh, lip uh, something. It's just amazing. And I like it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to go out and give it a big thumbs up. I know this was a long one. I debated splitting it into two, but I didn't do that. Uh, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Should we count how many we decluttered? Ooh, yeah, let's do it. rid of 42 lip products. Woohoo! Go me. Um, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!